Now you open all your, your hats and masks on, your non-sterile gloves, and the dressing is removed. You're going to open up your sterile blue kit. Okay. So this is where you're going to keep your one inch barrier. So you're going to open the blue kit away from you, uh -huh. to your left hand side, right hand side, and then down towards you. Okay. At that point, you're going to have two pairs of sterile gloves, a size seven and size eight. Okay. Eight is going to be the largest glove. Okay. When you put the gloves on, you reach from the bottom with your left hand, thumb inside, and you pull it onto your right hand. Right. Once it's on your right hand, you take your sterilized right hand, and you kind of do a little scoop where you go from the fingers, mm -hmm. scoop the glove, hold your hand up like this where the fingers are on the back of your hand mm -hmm. and your palm is towards you. Left hand is going to go right inside and just inside. Okay. If you miss a finger pocket on either your right or left hand, once you have both gloves on, that's when you can fix your gloves. Okay. So now that you have your sterile gloves on, you're going to take your two cleaning uh, sticks Mm -hmm. holding the circle beige part downwards Down. have gravity mm -hmm. help you break it open and we're going to go right to the driveline site and we're going to focus on the driveline site because the main thing we're mm -hmm. doing is we're preventing infection mm -hmm. so we're going to scrub that side so we're going to push down mm -hmm. we actually are going to push down and we're going to scrub back and forth or you can do circles but we're going to focus right on the side like this for about 15 seconds 10 to 15 seconds 10 to 15 once seconds. you've cleaned that you can then clean around just do one little pass mm -hmm. because on our skin everybody has bacteria on their skin mm -hmm. you do not want to clean around the skin and then go back okay if you do that that's called a secondary infection, infection. okay mm -hmm. and the whole point of this is to prevent infection so again right. it's going to be one stick, break, clean, 10 to 15 seconds, mm -hmm. then move off and clean around. And you don't need to scrub, just right. wipe. Okay? okay. Throw that first stick away right in the trash. Stick number two, same thing. Hold the applicator down, break it. We're going to clean the site again. So just right on top. We're going to clean, 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 clean. Now this time, instead of going around the skin, you just wipe down the drive line. Okay. Okay. Let that dry a minute or two. It's going to dry pretty quickly. Mm -hmm. You get underneath, you get the split gauze, a little split in it, that's underneath the tray. And just put the split around. You can use two pieces, four pieces, whatever it is you want to use. Okay. There's no set number you have to use. Cover it with a solid piece of gauze on top. Mm -hmm. um, once the gauze is on, you take your skin prep, which is that little mm -hmm. lollipop looking thing. Right. Open it. And that's only going to get a barrier between the skin and the adhesive of the tape. Mm -hmm. So with the gauze right here, you're just wiping across, down, across, and up. Okay. So the skin barrier does not clean skin. It does not prevent infection. It only makes a barrier for when, you're, when you remove the dressing the next day, mm -hmm. but you won't take all the skin with it. Okay. 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 Once you have the gauze on, the skin is prepped, let it sit for about a minute, give or take. Then get your tape roll ready and just open your tape up right on top. About four pieces across, so one, two, three, four. Mm -hmm. Same thing on the bottom, one, two, three, four. And then if you want to, you can do two to four right here across the middle. Okay. And that's that. And then if it's a day where you change the anchor, you would change the anchor after all that's done. So the What's anchor, the anchor? It's going to be right here off the side, right here. This kind of piece right here. Oh, okay. I mean, see how it's, it's still on her skin? So you don't need to change that today. Okay? Yeah, but I don't know. Actually, I haven't seen how to change yeah. that. Well, we'll do, we'll do that, that next time. Next time. Yeah, okay. I, I, I didn't bring one today. Sure, sure. Yeah. Okay. okay. And that's that. That's it? Okay. Yep. Okay, I'm going to ask you. He the the two pieces the uh -huh, the, the chlor uh, Yeah, uh, he will do first uh, the drive line. Okay. Right, you do not the, the drive line, the wound, the wound, because the mo right where it comes yeah, out of you, because that's yeah. the most important thing you are cleaning. Right. We are preventing infection where yeah, that drive line yeah. comes out of you. Skin over here already has bacteria on it, but mm -hmm. your skin is intact and solid. Versus there's always going to be little micro holes yeah. where that drive line